What's up guys, it's Suze here, back with another video today, and today I'm going to be telling another story, but with this story it's going to be pretty long, so get your popcorn for this one, it's going to be a fucking good one, as we're going to be talking about what happened to me over the summer, and how this girl and her very fucking stupid boyfriend tried to fuck me over, and one of my friends, but failed very badly, so getting into the story, we're going to call this girl Slag, and her very stupid boyfriend Bruce Lee, obviously not actual Bruce Lee, but it's a meme, so we're going to keep that as his name for now. So before this started, Slag would text me saying she broke up with him and tried flirt with me and then send me nudes. Also want to add here that this girl is 18, going on 19 at this time, I was 15 but now I'm 16 as I'm recording this. So basically this happened on a regular basis, I didn't tell Bruce Lee because we both didn't like each other because we hate each other without, or he hated me without any reasoning behind it but I didn't care that much as we were in this, but we were in the same friend group because one of my friends, while well, everyone else hated him and in this case we're gonna call this guy Mr. Shit FIFA because he is but this was Bruce Lee's only friend and I was the one, the only one who openly disliked him in my friend group and everyone disliked him behind his back but anyway over the summer Bruce Lee fell out with Mr. M. Shit of FIFA and now and we're happy we got rid of him so before this happened Mr. M. Shit of FIFA told Bruce Lee how she was sending me nudes and all that stuff and a lot of other friends in my, and to a lot of other friends in my group she was sending as well which I was unaware of but they were both attention seekers anyway so he didn't actually care for some reason which was fucking weird but anyway, about two months of summer went by and suddenly fake screenshots of me telling this girl to kill herself and making fun of her dead dad, which is really fucked up. Like, I would never say any shit like that. And, like, it's, like that's just fucked up, especially the dad thing. But, anyway. Uh, but anyway, the part that really fucking pissed me off is that I got these screenshots shown from my fucking mother. Like that's just fucked up for my like for my mother to see that shit which is like untrue which made her think completely different about me and that was like really fucked me over. So I was not having any of the I was not having any of this shit. After I explained the whole thing for my mother, she told me that she was going to the guards and I like I got her on my side, she's going to the guards with her for making fake screenshots and all this, which I was gonna like, what the fuck? Like it's I can just do this on my own. Anyway. Uh uh, I told her that Slag is just an attention seeker, which she is. Like, that's literally all she wants is this attention for some reason. And I don't even know why, it's fucking weird. And I told her it would go away. But it didn't. There were suddenly more fake screenshots. And soon enough, she was going to the guards, and my mother did. This shit, I was like, I was just like fine with this shit. I was only going to get worse then, which I knew. And it, then I was told if I told the guards about her sending me nudes that she put on the sex offenders list, which I very much disliked her at that point, and I was literally gonna fucking do. I was honestly tempted to do do a lot. I'm not gonna lie, but I was like, nah, I'm not. Let, I'm just gonna let this shit slide, let this go away, and I did. After she was trying to text my fucking mother, filling her head with bullshit, which she did, and then I like it didn't really. My mother said that like it didn't work with her and all this, but you know then. I was just kind of pissing me off more and I was like to my mother, I was like, I kind of want to go to the guards now, but she would not let me, that's how she filled her head of bullshit, so I was like, fine, whatever, I'm just glad this is all over and then, then we come back to school like a month later, and Bruce Lee had no friends because we were, his only friend, uh, Mr. M. Shit of FIFA, didn't want to be friends anymore, which, thank fuck for that, I was absolutely de delighted to find out. Where he sat on his own for the first few weeks until he reported me and Mr. M. Shea FIFA for bullying and lied to them saying we were laughing at him, which we weren't. And then I explained what happened over the summer to my principal. And then I was out of the situation. Easy. Now, I know if Slag and Bruce Lee see this, they're not going to be happy. But I didn't use their names, so you can't do shit really. So, unlucky. Bye.